Hey guys, video number three, and um, today I'm going to be doing a video on basically some clothes that I just picked up. It's just two dresses that I picked up. Um, two dresses, I was going to pick one for my um, senior pictures. We were supposed to have like a white dress on for our senior boat ride pictures, right? But um, I couldn't find, at the time that I was looking, I couldn't find a dress, so I found one online. And then the dress, the first dress that I got was, it was like a form-fitting dress. And I wouldn't wear a form-fitting dress for school pictures and stuff. So I just decided to get another dress. And the dress that I got was just a, um, more of a flowy type dress. The thing was that I wanted to do like a sweetheart top with a little bit of the back out. Like a little stripe design in the back or something to make it more cute. And girly like different than the other girls so i'm gonna show you the two dresses that i got offline one i got from um hot miami styles.com and this is the little business card that they got they came with it both of these came in bags so it was like wrapped in tissue paper and a bag um AO, i got one from AO, asos and then one from hot miami styles let's start off with the one from hot miami states <laughs> Hot Miami Styles because that's the one I got first. Um, this one is just like a um, it's just a let me take it off my hanger. Okay, so this one is just like a form fitting dress, and it looks really plain on the front. It looks like this, and then this is the back. So this is the main reason I got it for the back part because that would be so cute. But like I said, this is like spandex and it's really kind of form fitting on me. And again, I got it, like I said, I got it from HowMyUnionStyles.com. And um, I love this dress, but I hate the customer service and the shipping. Okay, I spent like $30 on that dress and then the shipping was like 6 6 or 7 That thing took like two weeks to get here and I i'm pretty sure it's in the u.s why is it taking two weeks to get here so um yeah <laughs> um i did not like the customer service because i think like they told me they were going to send me a message right and then so i went on the um email and they sent me a message saying that okay your package has been shipped and that was the first week the second week I typed them and I was like, um, where's my dress? And no one contacted me back. But then like three days later, I got my dress. So I don't know. I didn't like their shipping and stuff. So I don't think I'm going to be ordering from them anymore. Sorry. But then the second dress that I got, I love this dress. But the only thing I hate about it is I guess this was women's sizes. Because I got a 12 because I'm like a 12, 12 ish in juniors. But I got a 12, and I'm guessing this is women's sizes because, um, yeah, it's pretty big. It says that it's a um, US 12 and a UK 16, and this is huge on me. Um, I'm going to tell my mom to take it in some. I didn't read this part. This is some little crap that they sent. But like I said, this is from ASOS. And this, if you didn't know, AOSOS is, I think it's like a UK thing, UK thing. And I got overnight shipping. I got this in like three days. So I was pretty darn happy. But like I said, this is huge on me. This is what it looks like. It's pretty big on me. When I actually put it on, because it's like extra bigger in the weights part, that's the only part I don't like. And then, um, it's really pretty though, because I love the back as well. This one is more of a sundress type thing. And this is the back. And it just looks like that. And the front is like a kind of a sweetheart kind of thing. And it's got like a little keyhole in the front. But the thing is, I don't, ha I can't wear a bra because of the back part. So I'm going to have to get some type of little, some type of little, um, cup thing to go on so i'll still have some support so um hope you guys like this video i hope you guys like my hair i really like it 
I uh cut these little piece. The only thing that is not blending is this piece right here because like when I curl it, like when I do my big Kim K type curls, it has like a little, you know, like a little bit of layers. But when I did it like this, when I braided it and stuff, it didn't want to act right. No matter how much I comb it and stuff, it still doesn't want to act right. So I don't know. And um, yeah. Only left a little bit of leave out. Only left about this much of leave out out. That much. If you guys want to see how much leave out I left out, I will show you. Only left out this much leave out. This much. That's all my leave out. So that's not really that bad. I really don't mess with my hair. Um, the only thing I do to the, my actual hair is put a little bit of this Motions Oil Moisturizer, Hair Moisturizer, and it looks like this. And then I'll put a little bit of this Darby Oil. If, if, sorry, if you've seen my last, my last hair video, you've seen this oil in it, and I've used quite a bit. Because I've been using it on my client's hair and my hair. <sighs> So yeah. Oh, and one last thing. For my weave, I've been putting this um this uh dry shampoo on it. It works really well, guys. So if you want to try this, check it out. It's dry shampoo from Suave right here. And it what it does is just gets all the oil out of your hair. And what you do is you just do like spray it like this. And it's supposed to get all the oil out. Run your fingers through it a little bit. <coughs> it smells really good though. Run your fingers through a little bit to get the, the little residue off. So, and what it does is it just makes your hair a little bit more light and fluffy. So, this is what it looks like. Hope you guys can see that. It's like really bouncy and stuff. So, yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Rate, comment, subscribe, and bye, guys. Mwah.